a sexy gravy pour. Yeah, uh, oh, no, it's not very sexy, yeah, is it? Mine's been all over the place. Be more sexy. <laughs> ER, let's have the whole jug. There we go. <laughs> Fantastic. <laughs> What is up everyone, my name is Leah Shutkiva and I'm the UK's number one female competitive eater. I'm here today at the George Pub and Grill and I'm taking on this giant Christmas dinner. This platter is covered in everything Christmas. We've got turkey and sprouts, pigs in blankets, stuffing, potato, every variation of potato you can imagine, some parsnips, Yorkshire pudding and some greens just for health. And my opponent over here is Damien the Builder. Right, you all right there? Damien's a big eater, aren't you, Damien? Oh, yeah. And he thinks he can take me on today. So today, it's myself versus Damien with the Christmas dinner here at the George, and we cannot wait to see how much of this we can get through today. Right then, guys, on three, two, one, let's dig in. What is up everyone, Merry Shudsmurfs and welcome back to another video. So I am filming with On The Tools and taking on Damien the Builder in a six pound Christmas dinner challenge. Leave Damien on the back, underestimated just straight away, Leah. It's like going for a napkin. Yeah. I'm used to it now. Slow and steady when you lose. Excuse no, me talking with my mouth full, but no, it absolutely doesn't. In competitive eating, you have to be on the ball from the word go, otherwise you will absolutely not. You just you just, just take your cutlery, just go, take your cutlery and go. Unpopular opinion, but I really love sprouts. Oh, baby. Mmm. Those pigs in blankets are delicious as well. Smash it. I'm hungry. <laughs> are you going with anything in particular or are you just... I'm thinking veggies first and dip into everything else. How about your tactics? I'm going meat. Get the dry stuff out of the way first. It's a good shout. <clears throat> compared to things that you've done before, Leah. Way more delicious than so many challenges that I've done before. Way more delicious. I'm actually not mad. How does this compare to the uh, five kg kebab box? There's no comparison. I would do this tenfold over a kebab box. <laughs> but I think I put it on a brave, a brave face. I do not think so. Slowing down, Damien. I know, I feel like a very pig because I'm using my fingers and you're like cutting everything off. <laughs> We were up in Stockton filming at the George Pub and Grill, so I just want to say a massive thank you to Craig from the George for having us in and letting us film. It was so much fun. Damien's playing the long game. Mm. I feel like he's never watched any of the other videos, will you? No. <laughs> I wish I did know. Have you not watched any of the challenges? Nothing. No. I'm working all the time. <laughs> Always, on all the time right? <laughs> <laughs> Always on site. Always on site. I'm not eating. I'm going to leave you guys to enjoy the rest of this fairly interactive video. I hope that you all enjoy it. If you do, please remember to give it a like. As ever, if you have any comments for any future videos, then please just comment below. And if you haven't yet, please consider subscribing. I would love to have you on board and supporting my channel. Thank you all so much and enjoy the rest of the video. Hey, I'll always take tips. You <laughs> can cut that out. <laughs> <coughs>
I've had a lot of experience. I've been eat, eating all my life, so should be all right. And me, 29 years. <laughs> I'm only 18. <laughs> I think the mash is controversial, but I think it's there to sabotage, personally. What is, um, what we've what is actually on the plate? We have pigs and blankets, roast potatoes, sprouts, stuffing, which I'm not a massive fan of, mashed potato, parsnips, and they're candied parsnips. They're good, they're very rich. Yorkshire puddings, there were three on each. Some, I'm guessing this is like a carrot and swede mash. And then turkey, mm -hmm. and I think that's it. And there were loads of veggies in the middle, lots and lots of veggies. Um, um, if you can do mash right, I am a big fan of mash. Like a buttery, mm -hmm. yeah. That looks like a good, good mash. I'm a huge fan of a stuffing as well. Is it because you're on a diet that this is like? Yeah, <laughs> I, I could probably handle the match with my diet if I was small. Mm. See, I'm terrible. I put everything in bread. And I put mash in bread. Yeah, that. Mash in bread? Mm. Loves a mashed potato sandwich. Yeah. What? The red sauce, mash. I'm just trying to put you off. That's just, that's <laughs> so custard, odd. Custard on you, is not it? <laughs> I'm just spreading my mashed potato onto my roast potato, mm -hmm. as you do. Mm. <laughs> Wait, no, we have to settle this. Who else has had a mash sandwich? Mashed potato on bread. Who does that? Please comment below and let us know. And also, if you have any mashed potato sandwich hacks, let us know. Mm -hmm. yeah. Sandwiches. I just can't go over it. It's so weird. Like Carb City. I don't get this body by working out, you know. Oh, is that right? <laughs> Eating mashed sandwiches. You too can look like me. <laughs> No, but I am cold. That helps, I guess. You think so? Yeah. I'm like moving more. Oh, I guess, yeah. You've got to stand by the fire for a bit, just because if it chances Have a little chill out, a bit, yeah, yeah. yeah. Have a little nap while I'm at it. Maybe it'll still be here two hours later. <laughs> this is me breakfast, dinner, tea, and supper. <laughs> and tomorrow you'll be full. <laughs> sure. He is just playing with his food. <laughs> I've never known anything like it. I'm just wanting you to get the mash and then I'm going to just pie it all in my mouth. Right. Mary's mum is just like messing with me and she's nearly done and she looked over and there's like a whole 2kg of meat food left. <laughs> I just think like, why am I rushing it? I could just enjoy it a little bit, slow myself down, chew my food, which I'm really bad at. You just don't look like you. 
You just go normal pace. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know just how you're doing going it. at a normal. It's, <laughs> this is just me every day, mm. all day, every day. It's not. So you've got a dessert as well? Mm-hmm. She's got three kg of Christmas pudding left. <laughs> it's the cheese balls that I love Christmas. Love cheese so much. I've got like a really, I've got an affinity for good cheese. Oh, you these and make one look as bad if I eat me off the pudding. <laughs> Are you thinking this is Yorkshire puddings? Which is making you look bad at the moment. Or are you thinking that's maybe... Just, what can I say, I'm a gentleman. <laughs> Ladies first and all that. Yeah. <laughs> Feeling full now. Twenty-three thirty-six. So much potato. Mm. I give us a minute. You've got plenty of time before I get anywhere near you. Oh, I'm not worried about you, Damien. <laughs> but to be fair, it's a valiant effort. I hope I'm not the worst. You're not the worst. He's not the worst. I didn't even know they had touched it. It's you that's a normal one, and they're completely abnormal. I feel like you get the feeling drunk. I am, and I do, and my brain goes to mush. <laughs> I can't think of anything. And I'm trying to this tiny right bit in. of mash is gonna, is gonna be the end of me. I know it. But I'm going to get the rest mm. of the stuffing down because I don't really like it that much. I just feel like I need a big burp. That was on the back. <laughs> we all good? Mm. I'm, I'm thinking if I start long enough, it might just disappear. <laughs> <laughs> really struggling there on the mash. I feel like there's a lot of potato product in this uh, Christmas dinner, and uh, suspiciously so, but we managed to get all the way to the end, and I'm so, so proud. I hope you all enjoyed this video and enjoyed watching this little bit of struggle at the end, a little bit of a head shake, but. I am really, really proud of that. So I hope you all enjoyed watching me get through it. <sighs> Last bite. Thank God. Quick. Quickly, Damien, quickly. <laughs> you can do it. You can do it. <laughs> Missed a bit. <laughs> well done. Oh, God, I am glad that's over. 29 minutes and 7 seconds. Oh, that was savage. He'd be had gone. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think Santa Claus after it. <laughs> I love tryers. Also, guys, if you're on Instagram, follow me at Shutkeeper Official for some more real time posts and updates. I just feel a bit sick. <laughs> happens. <laughs> Food challenges are not easy. I don't feel like full full, I feel like it's there, but... I feel full full. Keeping it real, absolutely love that for me. Good work, shirts. Done yet, Damien? I'll eat this one. 
and that is what I like to see, some sheer determination and want to finish. Damien gave it his absolute all and he's an yeah, absolute finish. legend. So a massive thank you <laughs> to yeah, Damien, Damien for well coming <laughs> on and having a very, very good go. So I think that is just about it. If Damien is going <coughs> to throw in the towel. Yeah, it's thrown in. <laughs> throw in the napkin. Mm, throw in the napkin. My brain is not working. <laughs> Can't be. Normally I'm on my own though, so I can like bide my time, literally like hanging over the table like, oh, I need to outro. Right then guys, that is absolutely everything from us here at the George Pub and Grill. That was the Christmas dinner, absolutely smashed in 29 minutes. Damien over here was a worthy competitor, gave it all his might, but unfortunately... Yeah. The best lady won. <laughs> the best lady won, which is yeah. really sweet. Thank you all so much for watching. Merry Christmas.